Hello everybody and welcome to Jared Plays Hearthstone Arena. Now, this is the first time that I'm going to be playing in arena mode, so let me see. We have Warlock, Shaman, and Druid. I am not particularly experienced with any of these. Uh, so I'm just gonna go with Druid. Let's protect the wild. Now, pick a card to add to your deck. All right. So between these, Druids are not especially known for card draw. I don't think. I have no idea. Pirates, three, 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 Doomsayer. Okay, these are all kind of weird choices, but I'm gonna go with Doomsayer, even though it's very situational, very risky, um, very strange. Um, okay, and now, now I get all the card draw cards here, which is kind of ironic. Um, Acolyte of Pain can do a lot, um, but I'm gonna go with Novice Engineer. Bite, give your hero plus four, plus four, deal damage equal to your hero's attack to a minion. Okay, both of these spells are pretty cool, I think I'm gonna go with Bite this time. Wild Growth, a classic druid card, gain an empty mana crystal, that could be very useful. So I think I'm gonna go with that, even though Mark of the Mark of Nature is extremely tempting. I hope another one of those comes out. Soul of the Forest, very useful. Although I am starting to feel like I gotta worry about getting some minions here. Um, deal three damage to a minion. Wrath, again, very tempting. I think I'm gonna go with it. Um, now I'm gonna start worrying about some minions, although. Honestly, I'm not crazy about any of these minions. Um, Wisp could be cool with a buff card, like that plus four, plus four, or Soul of the Forest could be really useful before. And so even though, um, I don't know, everyone says Wisp is terrible, but it seems like it could be really interesting with some buffs. Um, destroy a minion, your opponent draws two cards. That sounds really bad. Although, no, that's that's rough. That's not very good, I don't think. Um, Youthful Brewmaster is good if you get some uh, battle cry stuff. I think I'm gonna go with Youthful Brewmaster. Um, Bloodfen Raptor seems like just a good, solid, all-around creature. Alarmobot is interesting, um, but I think I'm I think I'm gonna go with Argent Commander. Claw useful, Cult Master that looks pretty useful. I think I'm gonna go with Cult Master. Um, Scarlet Crusader seems pretty good in this situation. I'm not too crazy about any of these, but I might go with with um, a Moonfire here. Injured Blade Master is interesting. Defender of Argus is very good in a pinch, and like like I said with Wisp, it could be really useful um, to buff that up. And Wrath. Do I have I have one Wrath. And I'm pretty I'm pretty into Shattered Sun Cleric. It can be very useful. So I'm gonna get one of those. Archmage, Razorfin Hunter, Naturalized Destroyer. I'm gonna go with Razorfin Hunter here. I, I do need taunt. Frostwolf Grunt is not my favorite taunt. Um, but I already have some four mana creatures, so I'm I'll go with this. Innervate, very useful card. Claw, very useful card. Mark of Nature, oh man, I wish I wish I could take all of these. Uh, I don't have a Mark of Nature, so I'm gonna go with that. I don't have any of them, but 
Savage Roar seems very useful, although Harvest Golem is uh, tempting as well. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go with Harvest Golem. And I think I need a taunt here. Abomination is interesting. And I do have a lot of spells, so Violet Teacher could be really useful. I'm gonna go with Violet Teacher. Let's see how that works out for me. Mark of Nature. Oh, I that was the one that I got before. I wish. Anyway. Ogre Magi. How many attack based spells do I have? There's Wrath. Yeah, a lot of my spells are not attack-based, so Ogre Magi may not be the most useful here. I guess I'll go with another Mark of Nature. Nourish seems pretty good. Imp Master, interesting. Keeper of the Grove, that seems really useful. Another Mark of Nature there, jeez. Um, I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with Gulcher Footman because I have no one mana cards and it's a taunt. Even low low mana taunts can be useful in the late game, just like throwing them out there, complicating things for the other player. Do I have a Savage Roar? No, I'm totally gonna go with Savage Roar. Fairy Dragon, very useful. Mmm, yeah, definitely Fairy Dragon. Probably don't want a second Wisp, but I could go for a second Shattered Sunfire. Loot Hoarder, could, could be useful. Ancient Brewmaster, also could be useful. I'm gonna go for the card draw. Unless I have a lot of good battle cries. Actually, I'm gonna go for Angel Grimacer. Priestess of a Loon, restore 4 health to your hero. That's kind of tempting. Claw, very tempting. 6 for a 5 for... I'm gonna go for Claw. Demolisher is a pretty interesting card. Starfall, deal 5 damage to a minion or 2 damage to all enemy minions. Demolisher is cool, but it's better with more taunt in the deck, although I do have taunt giving cards, but I'm gonna go for Starfall because I have no 5 mana cards. And this, oh, ooh, I'm done here, I don't know how I feel about this deck, because I don't have very many good late game cards. Uh, we'll just see how it goes, we'll see how it goes. This is my very first arena, so you know. Um, be, have patience with me, and, you know, leave feedback in the comments, that would be great. I um, just, just started out playing Hearthstone a few days ago, so we'll see how this goes. I'm being matched with a worthy Al opponent. That's always good. I hear. will fight with honor. And the coin the is not my favorite coin. Not my favorite coin there. Uh, I, I could keep these. I'll, I'll mug in that one. Just because. That's good. Just lower mana. Can't do anything, so I will greet this paladin named well Fred Penner. And he says, well met in response. That's that's nice. I think what I'm gonna do is, oh, I was gonna just hero power, but getting novice engineer out there with some like card draw is oh, really God. useful, so we'll go with that. We'll see what he has to say in response to my novice engineer. 
fine, fine, fine. A wispy wisp. I could... In this situation, I could... Wrath. And then... Trade. Which would give me the card draw. Deal one damage to me and draw a card. Oh. Good Moonfire. But Novice Engineer is not the most useful engine, so I'm okay with doing that. It's a it's a pretty good trade, because he had three attack there. Okay, so he sent out the useful brewmaster, not really taking particular advantage of his battle cry, which is fine. Still a very decent minion. Uh, same stats as uh, Bloodpen Raptor, I think. We could definitely claw, although there may be a better plan. Hmm. Cult Master would just die. That wouldn't be great. We could Violet Teacher and then Moonfire. But I like to just. Actually. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I am ready to learn. So that I won't have summoning sickness. Even though, you know, there might be a better Moonfire later, but it's it's not a huge game changer card. So I feel like that was a pretty decent use. What's going on here? Silence. That's too bad. But I did get one apprentice out of it, so I'm I'm pretty pleased with that. Uh, I'm happy that I used the Moonfire so that I could get the Apprentice out before he was silenced. Coining into a secret. Uh, Paladin secrets? I don't know. I don't even know. Um, I like this trade. Shall do as you say. Drink with me, friend. Okay, that's interesting. I'm... I kind of like... Just taking him back out there. And then... I could give the Violet Teacher plus 4 health and taunt, which would keep it from dying. Or I could... Mm. Wisp and do that? That's interesting. Time waits for no one. See, what I want to do at some point is like throw a wisp out there, and then with Savage Roar, that's like an extra three damage for basically zero mana. Um, some mm. turn where it's more crucial than this turn. out there and my turn. Okay, so that's what he did. Get a taunt with divine shield. I am interested in what? Keep your 
character kills two tanks. Okay, I think I, I think I'm okay with this. We're gonna attack the great trade and. Oh, that wasn't the best, was it? That was not the best. Oh well. Because now we can trade for that, and that's not a favorable trade for me. Uh, I should... I should not have done that. No, that was good. Well, hopefully that doesn't end up, you know, losing the game for me. But we'll see what he has up his sleeve for six mana. Blood Red Corsair. Okay, so that wasn't a Bring me steel. particularly uh, efficient use of Red Corsair, but it didn't really matter because he does have port control right now. And that Red Corsair is getting buffed, which is, you know, pretty nice for him. I could just throw out a taunt. Um, and it would take a lot for him to, it would take a, a whole lot for him to take that down. But maybe there's something better I can do here. I like Fairy Dragon because it would, it would kill either of his minions and it's only two mana. I like Harvest Golem. Hmm. What a situation. So maybe I'll throw out those two. And then... Actually... Oh, whoops. I don't know what I... I just got... Oh, I should have attacked. Sorry. That was bad play. On my part, definitely. I got I got flustered there by the fuse. It wasn't even that far along. It was there. Pass me that arc light scanner. No wish inventor. I am starting to feel board control slipping away a little bit. A little, getting a little worried. Just my fairy dragon out here to protect me. Starting to wish I had summoned a, a wisp last turn. I, I wish a lot of things about last turn, let's be honest. Uh, I am. I kind of. I kind of dig Doomsayer in this situation. It's not the greatest use, but he's gonna have to do a lot to take it down. And it's just an interesting play. I'm interested. We'll see how it goes. Uh, no reason not to do that with Doomsayer out. And then I'm going to Hero power, and there's not much point in doing anything else. We'll see how it goes. It's the first time I've used Doomsayer, and you know, we'll see how useful it ends up being. We can't kill it with just these minions, so we need the charge or a spell card to take it out. And if he blows a bunch of cards to, to get rid of it, then you know, that's fine too. A lot of my constructed decks, I have Molten Giant because it really helps you if you're getting behind. Uh, that lets you, um, it costs less the more damage you have. So that actually worked out fairly ideally for me. I'm happy with how that went. Now I can throw out my Sunwalker, throw out my Scarlet Crusader. And 
You know what? I I kind of like I kind of like Wisp. You know, if he has some if he has a Consecrate and can kill the Wisp right off that, you know, that's fine. It's zero mana. But if he doesn't, I can buff it up and suddenly I have this big wall attacking him. Follow the rules. That's rough. That's rough. Hmm. Peacekeeper. If he's a peacekeeper, why does he have three attack? You know? That's... that's... I feel like that's how governments work. Like... I don't even want to go there. I don't even know. What am I saying? Okay. So, Wisp survived. <laughs> I could... give... Okay, so I think... We should. Hmm. Yeah, let's take out. Let's take out the bear. With me. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take out the bear. And then. Actually, someone here. I can't quite. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. Hmm. Savage Roar. Justice shall Swap. Kill. Or die. Attack. Useful for Master. Take this dude back in. I can't afford a shapeshift. Or I already did a shapeshift. But now, he lost his divine shield, he had one attack, and when we put him out again, he has that divine shield back, he has his four attack, and, you know, that's about as good a um, useful brewmaster as I can see happening in this game. So, where are we at? He has a few more cards. I mostly have board control. We'll see what he does with his with his jungle panther here. Okay, so he took it took it out of stealth to get rid of the wisp, which is not like it's not a bad choice, but it's one he probably isn't super happy about making. Deal five damage to a minion or two damage to all enemy minions. That's gonna be useful for later, definitely. I think it just makes sense to throw out my Sunwalker, take out this dude, I could give Scarlet Crusader plus 4 health and taunt. But in this case, I think I'm just gonna armor up and take out the Jungle Panther. Yep, yeah, that makes more sense to me. This is kind of a slow game, isn't it? We're, we're both, we're not top decking, but we both have kind of small hands. We're just kind of rolling along. Like, it's. How long have we been at 10 mana? Like, seriously. Uh, so sorry about the pace. I wish it was a little more action-packed here. This this Fred Penner is, you know, taking his time. So am I, to be quite honest. I am, you know, this is my first arena. I want to take my time. I want to make sure I don't do anything too silly. Demolisher and Corhound are both things I really want to get rid of. And I'm not too happy about them being there, but I'm just gonna Starfall. You know, get rid of the Corehound. He blew a lot of mana on it, I blew a little less mana on it. I'm getting rid of it. Sunwalker 
can take out this dude without too much trouble. I can take out this guy without too much trouble. Scarlet Crusader can attack. And we can toss out a blood hunter after. And and now this now I'm in a pretty strong position. We have very similar card hands, but I have a lot of board control, and we have the same amount of health. So I'm feeling pretty good about this position. He has the Light's Justice, which he's no doubt going to take out the Scarlet Crusader with. Reporting for duty. Even, but he will take some damage from that. Or maybe he won't take out the Scarlet Crusader? I would be surprised. Okay, that's very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Well... Okay. I am going to... Shapeshift. For the wilds. Take out some kind of group. And then... Plus four health and taunt. You need plus four health and taunt to Mr. Raptor. Join or die. Attack, attack, attack. And next turn is is going down unless unless something crazy happens. If I were him, I would swap this for someone, so that he could get the card drop. Yeah, looks like what he's doing, so he has some options. Fred has some options now. Not a lot of options, but some. We'll see what he does with them. I am I'm dying to find out. Your magic shall Silence. Not you know, that's solid, but unless he has a consequence. Oh. But he's still dead, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Reporting for duty. Oh wait a minute. Oh yeah, he's dead. Uh that And that's that's our first game. We gotta we gotta win. I'm I'm very Just pleased with that. Okay. Uh, was I, I think that was like a threat or something? I'm I'm that wasn't me being snarky. That was me like wondering which thing he clicked to get him to say that. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, feel free to click the like button if you enjoyed this video and. Uh, we're gonna leave it at that for now. This ended up being quite long, a bit longer than I expected, but thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.